Hi, welcome to the YouTube channel of Microtronics Technologies and today I am going to give you the demonstration of RFID based security system. This is the RFID reader, this is the DC motor which we have given uh, to show the demonstration of access allowed. This is the main circuit of uh, project RFID based security system. This message is shown on LCD. This is the microcontroller L293D IC Max232 IC. This is the relay. Now I will give you the demonstration of the project. Along with this project we have uh, given 5 cards that is 3 cards are valid cards and 2 are invalid cards. Invalid card means uh, there is no entry of the card into the program and for the valid cards uh, the number is entered into the program. Now let's take the demonstration with the valid card. Whenever you show the card it says X is allowed and the DC motor is rotated and after the some time the gate is closed. And whenever you give the demonstration with the invalid card you can see that the buzzer is turned on and message is shown on the LCD display. Let's take with another valid card. Now you can see that the number of the card is shown. So this number 1982807 that is from the card. Last digits of the card are shown on the LCD. Now I will explain you the circuit. Let's start with the RFID reader. So this is the RFID reader. It is connected with the DB9 uh, connector to the main circuit that is the microcontroller. This is the power supply. We have to give a DC or AC 9 volt uh, power supply to this circuit. This RFID reader has its own inbuilt uh, power supply uh, unit that is the power supply circuit. This is the buzzer. It will be uh, activated whenever you sh show any card. So it can be a valid or invalid card. Uh, the buzzer will be turned on for both cards. So as you can see the buzzer and the LED is turned on whenever you show the card. This is the DC motor. It is connected to the uh, project with the help of L293D. The 8051 microcontroller cannot drive the DC motor since the output of microcontroller is of 5 volt. So the voltage and current output of microcontroller is not sufficient to drive the DC motor. That is the reason we have used this uh, L293D IC in the circuit. It is called motor driver IC. The next important part is the project circuit. This is the main uh, PCB of the project. I will explain you one by one. This is the 16 by 2 alphanumeric display. This is 8051 series microcontroller. To be specific we have used 89S51 microcontroller. This is the potentiometer which is used to uh, vary the contrast uh, of the LCD display. This is the Max 232 IC. These four capacitors are required for this Max 232 IC. Here you can see this is 12 volt relay and a 12 volt buzzer. The transistors are required to drive the uh, relay and the buzzer. This is the main important part of the circuit that is the power supply part. To operate this project we have used this DC adapter. We have used a 12 volt DC adapter. This circuit can be drive, driven through a 12 volt transformer or a 12 volt battery or a 12 volt adapter. So as of now we have used a 12 volt adapter. This out, output of the adapter is given here. After that it is given to the bridge rectifier. These four diodes form a full wave bridge rectifier. Then the next part is 7805 and 7812 voltage regulator. Before that we have used a 1000 microfarad filter capacitor. These two are output LEDs. So this is for the 5 volt uh, power supply indication and this is for the 12 volt power supply indication. So that's all about the demonstration of the project RFID based security system. Thank you.